We got the audio fixed, at least with the microphone, so appreciate everybody being understanding. We're going to head on back out and get some more MMA going here in a minute. Hope you guys had a chance to talk to some of the fighters. We got a couple of really big fighters out here today. Actually, there's more than a few. But I always know some of them get embarrassed. We brought into the ring. Um, yeah, don't forget the next one. Can I take a look at it? All right, thanks. You know, one of the favorite local boys out in the whole entire Hampton Road area is Antoine. He's been fighting for a really long time. I think I've been there since your very first fight. And uh, I've been watching you. Huh? Don't worry. Oh, the belly? Don't worry. Well, mine is right here. Feel that. Anyway, so you've been, you know, you've been fighting for a lot of years. You know, obviously with Strike Force, recently brought out by the UFC. So you are on literally the biggest stage possible in mixed martial arts. Tell so everybody here tonight at Epic. Uh, what's going on with you, Antoine? Um, well, I was actually supposed to be fighting next weekend out of Seattle on the Strike Force car, and unfortunately, uh, my opponent, the Noah Bullet Fork from American Top Team, got injured uh, in training, so they called off the fight, so I'm just going to have to wait for the next one. Hopefully, hopefully, uh, late July, they're going to get me on another car. So just training, you know, get my weight down. I'm moving down from the 205 pound weight class to the 185 pound middleweight class. Cardio good, my, my weight good, and just, you know, getting ready for that weight class. So, look forward to it. All right, so, I mean, obviously going down to 185 pounds, a totally different weight division. You know, people think, well, 205 to 185, that's not a big cut. 20 pounds is a big cut, you know, I mean, especially, you know, you, you know at that point, being your size, you don't really have a lot more to lose. What made you say, you know, I'm going to take my, my mixed martial arts to another level and uh, go into this new weight division? Well, I mean, you always want to be a, a, as big a fish as you can and as small as pond as you can. So, you know, I, again, like you said, I wanted to kind of take my, you know, take everything to the next level, get my cardio where it needs to be, and just more than anything, live a healthier lifestyle. You know, I was cutting weight, getting to a while, and it was really easy for me. So, I think if I can, you know, live a healthier lifestyle, eat cleaner on a day-to-day -day basis, and walk around about 200 pounds, you know, I'll be in better condition for my life. All right. So, when you say healthier lifestyle, I mean. Are you talking about cutting out uh, beverages? Or are you talking about like changing uh, from like maybe vegetarian, getting rid of certain meats or junk foods? Or what are you talking about in terms of eating healthier or being healthier? Well, my fiance takes me to Five Guys burgers all the time. So. Yeah. <laughs> so I'll lay off the Five Guys and you know, I, I don't drink a whole lot, but when I, when I do go out and drink, you know, I have fun with it. So laying off of that, just trying to eat clean, a lot of fish and veggies and all that stuff that rabbit eats. So. You know, if I had said I'm laying off the five guys, I think people would think a little bit differently, but you're saying it. So from now on, Antoine is laying off the five guys. Make sure everybody feels a lot safer. Trip is laughing at that. Antoine, congratulations on your career. Hopefully your fight will come up in July, you were saying. And uh, make sure you guys keep up with Antoine Witt, his career on Strike Force, and maybe someday we'll even see him in the UFC. Thanks for coming in here.